Missing two of their top three hitters in Ryan Jones and Cameron Flynn, the Copperheads' bats would need to be potent in order to beat the first place Licking County Settlers. But would the offense be hot enough? At first, it looked promising. Spencer Payne connected for his first home run of the year to put the snakes up early. He takes us through his at-bat. He was kind of a slower throwing left-hander, so it took me a couple pitches to kind of get used to it. And then the 0-2 pitch, he hung a changeup. I hit it pretty good. The Settlers' juggernaut offense would rise up soon enough. Tyler Wynn's two-for-four night consisted of driving in all three runs to put the Settlers on top three to two. David Schwabe would finish with an impressive four-for-four four with three runs scored and one RBI for the game. Danny Gifford's performance was the Snakes' bright spot, throwing two and two-thirds innings of no-hit ball. But in the end, the Settlers would pile on 12 hits in the 8-2 win. The team may be in a slump, but Payne is optimistic. I mean, we just got to get the bats going a little bit. We're, we're definitely missing our hitters like in Cam and Ryan, so uh, I think we'll get it turned around, though, later. Reporting for the Copperheads, I'm Maddie Kuhn.